Hi guys, welcome to my crazy life. It's Lori and I have a Shein haul for you today. I might have gotten a new mug. Uh, my friend Lisa, thank you Lisa, in Canada picked this up for me from Tim Hortons. Uh, my coffee's not hot right now, but this donut changes colors and the bats on the back change into little Timbits. I love it. And then he's got his little Timmy hose. Iced coffee. It's adorable. Mm. And I'm drinking coffee out of it. Hi, Al. Well, then, Kim, what can I do for you? You gonna come say hi to our friends? Yeah? Yeah? He said, oh, lady, what are you doing? Okay, get down. There you go. Uh, that was Wellington. I'm sure Alex will be over shortly. All right. It's a, not a giant haul, but I did want to share it with you. So the first thing I got, it's an anxiety bookshelf. I'm not shaking it because that gives me anxiety. Oh, I lost the book. But it's a little bookshelf with all these little tiny books. And there's extra books because I have room for more. But look at this one. It's wicked. And it's hi wellington there's it doesn't open so i think it's like four. excuse me what do you need come on um but it does have individual little books in it if you can see that and they have and they sit on the shelf and then if you're stressed out you can shake this and all the books fall out but we're not going to do Mm -mm. Ah, but my Wicked book keeps falling down because I keep messing with it. But I want it on the middle shelf where we can see it. So I'm going to put this on my little trinket shelf. Okay, so I got that. And then I ordered this. This is like houseware stuff. By the way, free shipping. Descriptions are in the box below. This is all some fun stuff that I needed for some home. Hi. Hi. That I needed for some home stuff. So that's what I picked up. This here tape goes either around your toilet. Hi, Wellington. Or in my case, uh, I can't think you can see it. But there's a crease in it right there. And I'm going to put this up against my tub. Between my bathtub and my um vinyl floor and it just makes it look nice and tidy i have i need to replace my vinyl floor but i haven't done that yet okay hi that hurts sir don't be rude um so i i have one on there now but i figured i could replace it and it you just peel and stick so you would i have the one on there and here's how it goes so you would bend this and then this piece sticks to the bathtub and this piece sticks to the floor and it gives you a seam. So what I'll do is rip the old one off. I'll give it a really good cleaning and make sure there's no dust or anything. And then I will stick this to it and it will look nice. So we did that. Um, also, I grabbed one of these. Um, it's one of those foot cheese grate. Hi. Hi foot cheese graters, you know, for your dry skin and calluses and stuff. It has a little protector, which I like. And then you, like, I will soak my feet in the tub and then rub this and it will sloth off the dry dead skin. Especially this with winter time, my feet, and being diabetic, my feet get very, um, gross dry so here's the thing though also being diabetic be very careful you do not want to go too deep all right then i found this and i thought it was genius it is just a usb it's a charging cord it's the fabric one which i like but this one has a type c it has a micro usb and i use all three of these and it has one for my iPhone. So I don't have the newest iPhone. I have a 14 Pro Max. And this is for that. So when I travel or I go somewhere and I need to charge a couple things, I only need to bring one cord with me. And I thought that was genius. I did see on a TikTok they had these ones that 
click between a type C and that, which I thought was great, but I also do use the micro USB for charging things. So I got this and it has a decent cord and it was very reasonably priced. So I picked up that. Then I got, um, well, this is funny. So if you have paid attention, I, I watch a lot of TikToks and decorating stuff and I'm getting ready to do my mantle for Christmas. And they're hanging these big, beautiful bells off the garland. And so I said, well, I'm gonna order all this from Shein. So first I thought I would order the garland. We're not using this garland. First of all, it's very stiff and I wanted something that, um, this is, I'm gonna use this, but not for my mantle. I wanted something that um, would hang a little nice, you know, and drape. This is definitely not that. This is very stiff and harsh, but it will do perfect outside over my front door. So we'll use it for that. And it's on a cord that you can bend it and it will stay and hold its shape, which is nice. So if you're gonna do like an over the door or something and you need, or outside, I think this is perfect. So I grabbed that, which I'll take outside. And then I grabbed, I bought bells and I was like, oh, I can't wait to put them on my mantle. No girl, these are not the right size. Look at the measurements. I mean, they're adorable bells and I will use them, but not on my giant mantle. So this will hang off a little shelf in my kitchen, I think, with a little tiny garland. Um, so you get six bells. They're already pre-strung. You can always restring them if you want, maybe three somewhere else. And they, they jingle. I love them. They're just not what I thought I was ordering. I thought I was getting a big set. And it's fine. It's fine. It's all good. And then the last thing I ordered, I'll show you the box because that's important. So it came in this box. Um, these are your directions, so don't throw your box. Hi. Don't throw your box. Would you stop? I talk to him like he can hear me. Don't throw the box away because that's how you put this thing together. But what this is for is under my sink. Um, it's a shelf. I hope it fits. I'm going to have to show you like this. But it's a shelf. But it also slides open, so, and then these move, these sh come off and move, so you make room for the um, plumbing. So this can go around your plumbing, through your plumbing or whatever, and then you just make your adjustments um, on how you want it to fit. So you can remove these pieces, you know, snug it up under there. And hopefully, I haven't tried this yet, but hopefully it, um, here, we'll do our thumbnail. Hopefully it will, oops, um, fit under my sink. And I'm pushing these together from building it. Fit under my sink and hold all my cleaning product and stuff in my kitchen sink. If it does not, then I will try it under one of my other sinks, but I I purchased it from my kitchen. All right, so the things I used, um, this did not come in the kit, but these are very handy when you're putting stuff together. I actually got this with another kit I bought to, for my plant stands. This came with it and I have kept it in my craft room up here and it is perfect for building things. You'll want some scissors, obviously, to open packaging and stuff. But, yeah, I'm excited. I need to take care of my pedicure and get everything together. So, I hope you enjoy. And you've got a little sighting of Mr. Wellington. He wants treats is what he wants. And they are generally on that, oops, nope, on that shelf right there. But they're not. I, moved, I gave him some treats already and moved them. All right. Well, that's everything. I hope you enjoy. Check out the description box below and I will talk with you later. Bye.